Hey royalty, hey emperors, hey empresses. This video is going to be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. And before we begin, I'm wishing y'all the benefit of peace, love, and light always. First things first, I only have one Instagram and one YouTube page. It's at Make the Dreams. Don't get scammed. I'm not the one that's emailing you or DMing y'all for readings or for money. I don't do that. You can only book a reading with me through my link tree, my website, which will be listed down below in the description box. Okay? And if you guys haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. I love y'all so much. Let's begin. Angels, ancestors, we are guys of the highest white light. Please come down and protect me. Please come down and give me clear my hand and the divine. Archangel Michael, OG, please come down and protect me as I channel this different energy. Please and thank you. And please come down and protect the viewers that have clicked on this video today. What are the messages for Sagittarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North and North. Sag, if you are doubting yourself, it's time to stop. Okay? You're winning. You have success coming in. Like I said that, I saw a one, one, one on the timer. Ooh, it's a lot of new beginnings coming towards you. A lot of prosperity, okay? A lot of new energy. You guys are being led to make space in your life for the new blessings that are coming in, okay? Success is coming in. Get ready for it, and it's yours. I cannot make it up. You're ready for it. You're ready. It's like it's, it's your time to shine. It's, your, it's, it's, it's the next chapter for you, okay? It's like you're, you're getting ready to receive blessings from up above. For some, this could be a child, a family. You're able to balance out your masculine side and your feminine side. You're receiving spiritual gifts. It could also be knowledge. I don't know why I'm picking up this, but you guys can study like the Akashic Records. Or you're just getting ready to have a lot of spiritual knowledge, ancestral knowledge. You could even astral project, okay? It's like I'm speaking to royalty. You could be understanding that you're royal. Yeah, and God is going to be sending you people to help you, okay? It's like you could be asking different questions at the time trying to get certain knowledge you're trying to get certain questions answered and it's like certain people are going to be directed towards you to give you those answers to help you yeah for some this could be from now up to a year from now okay so different things could be changing from now up to a year from now but it's a yes it's a yes this is also a test of patience okay of your willpower of your obedience to god of your obedience to self Okay, uh, of some of the contract that you could have made with up above, letting God know, okay, you're gonna do this, you're gonna do that. So it's like continuing to, to work on it. And you're being watched by up above. I'm picking up on this to do. You're getting ready to come into your your spirit, you know, your spiritual family. They're getting ready to come around and help you with people coming towards you and helping you. Oh, that was the card in the deck. But it's like you're gonna have help. You're gonna have help, okay? In regards to healing the earth, where we live, where we are, okay? There goes that balance of duality, okay? Light and dark, the, the moon and the sun, complete balance, equilibrium in all aspects. Wow, you're getting ready to hear a yes, all right? And you have no need to worry. I just said that in the beginning. You guys have no need to worry at all. You guys can be stressing out, saying, you know, why hasn't this happened yet? It, it's coming. It's getting ready to. That's the thing. It's getting it's getting ready to. Tell me more. Yeah, you have some type of maid that's also watching you. So be mindful. Y'all got to have, like, monitoring spirits if you're seeing, like, flies, roaches, moths, insects. Okay, I just think that somebody's watching y'all. They got dark, low vibrational energy, okay? Yeah, there's also someone here that's going to try to tempt you or to, uh, make you feel like, you know, you need them or you, you're in deep love with them and it could just be lust or manipulation. Be mindful of that. This is someone that may have children or they have children lying for them, all right? To make them seem like they're a better person than, than who they truly are. This is someone that's on straight bullshit with you. Okay, somebody's on a straight bullshit. They're a liar. They're very deceptive. They're a con artist. They're snaky, flying. Okay, and this is someone that has been lying on your name. 
I like this energy. Yeah, look at this. And everything backfired on them. All right, this is someone that is refusing to let you go. But it's like your ancestors are like, they got you messed up and they got them messed up. It's a no. It's not happening. Okay? Yeah, you're also being led to keep loving the way that you love. Okay? Don't change who you truly are. Don't change who you are. Continue to walk in your purpose. See what the kids watch. Oh, Woo! You a chosen one. Oh, God, it's his hands on you. You have nothing to fear. You probably see your life elevate in ways that you have never imagined. And people are upset about this. I cannot make up. All the backside and stuff that they were doing is getting ready to come back towards them. Okay? They could have also been wanting you to say yes to different things. I was making you switch your energy around. It could have been an energy vampire around you. Like really draining your energy. And they are not loyal. This is someone that cannot be trusted. Okay? You're also a celebrity. Yeah, somebody is getting ready to get caught cheating. Look at this. They're getting ready to get caught cheating. Somebody has already been gone. They're lost. Yeah. And they want you to take more time before making the decision. So they do different things. And they come back towards you. Try to guilt trip you. This is a con artist. This is a liar. This is a snake. This is someone that's slimy. Okay. I have to light another incident. Because my incident then went out off of this energy. It burned out so quick. I mean, it was already towards the, the end a little bit. But it was like the way it burned was like, whoa. This energy is could be really draining. Okay, somebody has a very strong draining energy. They may feed off of others to get their food for themselves. They don't know how to get their own energy, or they don't know how to pray to God to fill them. Okay, with the energy that they need, they'll rather take from others or take from you because you could be a celebrity. You could be on your way to stardom. Six five four. As I said, this you're on the up and up. And you're also being led to continue doing something that you were born to do that somebody wants you to stop doing. Yeah, these people are losing their mind or this person's getting ready to lose their mind, okay? They're also going to really lose it when you move into your dream home or your dream home is coming. You could have Libra in your chart or you could be connecting to a Libra. Yeah, you hold so much good weight in the spiritual realm. You really do, okay? If you're getting ready to meet your emperor, you could be this emperor, yeah, look at this. Keep doing something that you were born to do. God does not want you to stop. You're being tested. People are trying to make you stop doing something. Okay, you're chosen. I cannot make it up with judgment. You got Scorpio in your energy. You not one to play around with. I cannot make it up. Something is over with. Father God is putting an ending to a situation because enough is enough. People keep playing with you. They keep playing on your name and enough is enough. They're going to respect you. Okay, it's like people are going to learn how to respect who you are, respect what you do, respect re respect your talents, your gifts that God instilled in you, blessed in you. They want something to not be over with, but it's over, it's done. It's over to these burdens, it's over to the strife, it's over to the weight, it's over to the pressure, Sagittarius. It's an ending to these burdens, this conflict, okay? Yeah, it's disinterested, you're saying no, you could be rejecting somebody, you're just completely rejecting a situation out of your life. You have people from your past that are stressing out, that want to come back towards you, that want to try to reconcile with you. Yeah, look at this. And it's because you could be very spiritual at this time. You could be connecting to God up above. There you go again. Chosen energy. Okay, yeah, look at this. Somebody here wanted you to give to them. You could have been, you know, they could have been selfish, self-centered. Now they want to give to you because they're very burdened. They're very weighed down. They're very stressed out. They're very overwhelmed in their life. And they see you elevating somebody from your past wants to get back into a connection with you or they want to marry you they want to be in something serious with you but this is not somebody that you could trust yeah situation has been put to rest your angels are like leave it alone it's time to heal from this it's time to reflect it's time to let this go somebody's a liar they, they were trying to lie to you deceive you because they know that you have true real love that's meant to come towards you ace of cups energy 55 is here. There's major changes coming in. You also have the Ten of Pentacles. This is complete abundance, wealth, prosperity, blessings, loyalty. Yeah, somebody here wanted you to be confused about different partnerships that were coming and they did not want you to give to them. Okay? And it's like, now you could be more open to it after healing, after gaining some type of enlightenment. Now you could see the truth about how healthy partnerships are coming in from God to help you get to the next level. Yeah, to help you move forward past some type of blockages or obstacles. You're getting ready to have your happiness. Nine of Cups. And these people are stuck. This person is stuck. Whoever this energy is. It could be a Pisces, a hangman. These people wanted to try to delay your happiness and they were watching Somebody here spying on you. They want to gather information on you. What's the page of swords? They want to know what you're doing. It could be a, a water sign. 
okay, watching you, or someone sees that you're very loving, you're very intuitive, you're very kind, you're truly who you say you are, they could be wanting to come towards you. What's the Queen of Cups? Somebody has been lying on you. Yeah, look at this. Somebody here has been lying so that they can have a new beginning. This is really somebody who's very bitter and unhealed, but they could be someone who's trying to come across as very loving or empathetic or spiritual. Somebody here could be like a, trying to come across as spiritual, but they lie. It's a sword to never verse. They, they've been lying. Yeah, they, yeah, they've been also lying to a king of pentacles in the reverse. So they can have a new beginning here. So they've been watching you to see what you've been doing. Okay, to see if you've been with uh, a king of pentacles. They've been lying to this king of pentacles. What's the What was the lie to the king of pentacles about? Yeah, to make this person cold towards you. Okay, the king of swords are really, are really cold towards healing or finding balance, equilibrium in their life. Okay, somebody here was really financially destitute, really in a place of facing bad karma. King of pentacles in the reverse. Somebody here made just really nice, so they have a nice car, a nice home, but their bank account was on zero. They ain't got nothing in the bank. Somebody is a liar. They're a con artist. They're very greedy, slimy, money hungry. This woman could have wanted to have a new start or it could have just been about the sex. Yeah, and that's coming to an end here. Somebody here was in an illusion and it's coming to an end. This woman was stringing this man along and making him go broke. With her, with her manipulation, she can have children by this person. Yeah, God exposed the truth that this man was being slowed down or there was a major delay. This could have been happening for, for months, even years, but the Knight of Pentacles, this is the slowest moving night in the deck. Somebody's no longer juggling the situation. They're letting it go. Yeah, they're, they're quickly rushing towards um, a renewal here in the call of God, understanding what's going on in their life. Yeah, somebody here's trying to cause drama, okay, because they found out some type of truth or they see something on the phone. They got some type of clarity, page of principles. They got some type of insight. It's this devil energy. Somebody here knows the truth that there's going to be a reconciliation or a celebration that takes place, okay, and they're heartbroken about it. They're really betrayed. They feel heartbroken that somebody's getting ready to have true real love in their life. And it's Devon Thomas. Somebody here is highly favored, blessed. Okay, that they're upset at you, Sagittarius, because you're winning. Okay, Scorpio, Taurus, Sagittarius, Aquarius energy is here. Okay, you are, it's like you're, you're receiving good karma. You have all these new blessings coming towards you. And these people are heartbroken over this because they've been really trying to put in the work to take from you or to get you to give to them. Okay, yeah, look at this. The king and the queen of pentacles in the reverse. This could have been a couple doing this. <clears throat> or some, or this man could have just tried to be with you because your financial security, your stability, what you have. Or this could have been a Libra or Earth sign doing this. Okay, could be up the Queen of Swords. These are, yeah, look at this. You're being guided towards who you're supposed to be guided towards. And these people, somebody here is leaving this energy alone, Eight of Cups. This man could be leaving this woman or this woman is leaving this man. But somebody is leaving this and they're being guided towards their true love in their life. Who they're, who they're truly supposed to be going towards. Okay, yeah, they got their guard up. They already know this is the, direct, the right direction they're supposed to be heading towards. They're leaving the individual out in the cold that's a liar, that's very deceptive, that's a con artist, that's money hungry, that's really broke, destitute at a loss of life, okay? Someone here is leaving that completely alone. They are going ghost. They are going and they are truly listening to themselves, their intuition at this time, okay? Yeah, and like I said, there's gonna be a reconciliation. So this man could be coming back towards you or this woman could be coming back towards you after believing lies about you because this person just wanted to have sex with them, okay? It's very sick. It's like, ugh, look, freakily. <laughs> Somebody here wants to reconcile with you, Sagittarius, and they feel like you are their person to a cup. They want you. Okay? Yeah, they feel like you have avoided a tower or coming towards you is going to avoid this tower. They feel like you have peace in your home. You are peace. Ooh, it could be a Scorpio doing this. Get ready, Sagittarius. This is fire energy. It, for, for four of wands. Your home is very peaceful, and it is it, and wherever you stay is covered. And it has no chaos. Tower in the reverse. It doesn't exist there. Ooh, you're going to have a choice. I hope this helped you. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. May peace and blessings be to you always. And I will see you on the next video.